Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to install R, the, the R language, R Studio, and R tools, and also the RCMDR package. So all these will be included in this video. So we need to install some of the applications. So all the links that you can see in this browser, I will add all these links in the description of this video. So you can take those links from there. All those links will be uh, uh, updated links only. So those will work. So first we need to install the R, R language or R definitely that, that we need to install. Then we need to install R studio and then we need to install R tools. Now from the R studio link itself, that is the posit.co link, you can directly install R, but it will again re redirect to CRAN R studio only. So you can use R project, this CRAN R project to install the R. So once you go to this three part, then you have to for this one, CRAN R project.org to install the R, just click on this download R studio, sorry, download R for Windows. It will be downloaded and some something this kind of application will be downloaded in your machine. Then next we need to inst uh, yeah, download this R studio. For this, uh, the link will be there. So go to that link and click on download R studio desktop for Windows. And then once you download that, something like this will be downloaded in your machine r studio 2024 12 1 something like that next you have the r tools so this uh, link also will be in the description so you take it from there and this is the r tools 45 installer so if you are using windows 11 windows 10 so you can use that and for arm uh, you can use this one and for uh, mac OS and linux the process will be same but the installation uh, like the installation type will be different so you can do that so for this one install r you can directly take it from here or you can take it from the link itself so once you download all these three something like this you will have in your machine so first i need to install the r okay so it will be in default settings only all these installations will be easy just the rcmdr package installation will be the most important part so coming to next next and keep it as it is default as it is default and then next then please specify uh, startup options do customize startup options so as it is default and then again default so create desktop shortcut like this we can take and it will be installed so once it is installed we will move for the r studio again the default settings only we will use the path and everything it will take as it is next r tools also we will install but uh, r tools why it will be not that much important uh, for this because if any package which is not matching the current version of R, in that case to install that from source, we use the R tools. But mostly for our cases, we can install all the packages from R Studio itself. So that will not be needed that much R tools, but to be in the safer side, we are installing R tools. So this R is installed. <coughs> Next, we are going to install the R Studio. So again, R Studio. In this R Studio, uh, we are going to give again same C program files R Studio as it is. Install. It will be installed. And uh, once you install the R Studio inside R Studio, you can install all the packages. Anything you can install it there. So there will be not any problem. Even if you don't install R, R tools, there will be not any problem. But to be safer side, definitely we are going to install R tool R, R tools also. In this video, I am not going to skip any part. So you can skip this part while this is getting loaded and you can uh, start seeing the R tools. Inside this R studio, we are going to install RCMDR package that we will try from the basic uh, the way that we uh, install, but that will not work once you start that. So how we are going to do that, I am uh, I, I, I will show that to you. So R studio is installed. And now we are going to open the R Studio. So this is the R Studio. You can see it is installed now, right? So once you do that, uh, there will be one option for choose R installation. Is your machine default 64-bit version of R? That just we have installed this one, R 4.5.0. This one, and then auto detect anything as it is. Then OK, and it will open you uh, the R Studio from Posit. This one. So you can see here, this is the workspace and everything is environment workspace. Everything is here. Now, if you see here, we have some, uh, you can see some of the system library we have here, which are already installed. 
now we can uh, see before going to rcmdr i am going to install the r tools also so let's install the r tools then we will go to rcmdr package save version information uh, to registry create start menu icons all this you can keep it is and then again install so it will be installed and meantime it is getting installed uh, i will tell two things here from this workspace we can install packages the command will be install dot packages and then whatever package we want to install we can do it from here next from here we have option uh, in the packages section you can see there are files plots and everything we have help viewer presentation in the packages section you have the install and update option so all this you can see here system library these are already by default we got with this r studio but if something else you want need uh, you want and uh, that is not here for example, this uh, R uh, RCMDR. See, RCMDR is not available here. So what you need to do, you can click on install, and it will search in the CRAN repository, and then uh, you have to mention the package name. For our case, we will install the RCMDR. I will show here the process. But before that, uh, let's see how much it is there. Okay, let it be installed. I don't think it will create any issue in the RCMDR package. So while you just click on install and if you select rcmdr it will show you rcmdr and rcmdr miss so just click on rcmdr install dependencies click on install so something it is getting installed here right and after that you will see the rcmdr here so let's let's wait till it uh, it is getting installed and meantime this is the r tools so let's see you can skip this part The R tools will take some time and while you are doing this RCMDR installation if this is working then fine everything is fine there will be not any issue but if this is not working then we have to go with some different uh, approach that I will show here before that we will see now lots of packages here so all these are actually dependencies RCMDR dependencies so while installing that we have this check mark also you have to check while installing the rcmdr you should select this install dependencies from here sometimes when you do that then also we give we get the problem so for that reason we have some different approach to install that but first you can check this if this is not working then you can try this second option okay first option is this one and then it will uh, you will see lots of uh, libraries are here now because all these are dependencies which are installed from there so now you have the rcmdr and rcmdr misc so i'm just clicking on rcmdr you can see all these things here and then get into packages again rcmdr so if you see here now rcmdr is getting loaded so if it is getting loaded and you are getting this small arrow it means your package is successfully installed if not see here my screen is stuck here so it means the installation is not completely done but while doing this if you check uh, like the first step for some it can work but for some what or i can say for maximum this step will not work and this screen will be stuck here nothing will be progressing here we can see so this r tools installed so in that case what you we need you need to do we need to go to the uh, task manager and we need to kill this r studio first so not task plus settings so we need this task manager and we need to kill this uh, RStudio first of all. So end task. RStudio is closed now. And again we need to open the RStudio. Now I will show you the last option for this installation or whatever. You can try the first one and then you can do that. So why I have shown this process because we need to we may install some other repository sorry uh, other packages that you can install it from here. But for this RCMDR. It, it doesn't work like that from directly there sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't so you use this command I will also give this command in the description you can take it from there directly install dot packages okay then rcmdr we will give rcmdr here okay so rcmdr and then dependencies dependencies equals to true and then again we are going to give enter 
so it will again install uh, the things let us wait for some time and see some extra packages also again got installed other than the packages that we have already installed using the packages or this option install option so other than that also some more packages got installed here now we will try with this rcmdr from here you can directly click on this mark and it will start automatically so rcmdr here uh, rc mdr one minute RCMDR, where it is? Yeah, this one so now we will wait for this to open see now we have this rcmdr r commander open so it means rcmdr is now correctly working so in this way you can install the rcmdr so first step you can check with this install packages option if that is also not working for you just use this command what i have used here install dot packages rcmdr dependencies equals to true in there also we have selected dependencies equals to true but this sometimes works sometimes it doesn't work so that's why we are using this command directly you can directly use this command also no like but you should know that from, we, we can install packages from install packages option uh here lots of uh, packages you can get from here so that's why i have shown this step but you can skip this and you can use this one also so this is how we can do that and now coming to our tools so this is the art tools it is already installed in this art tool what we can do we can take the packages from source and we can install it in case the packages are not getting installed because of version mismatch so that we can do it here so all these uh, four things are installed our language our studio our cmdr package and our tools so if you are facing any issue in any step you can comment and or maybe we can connect so yeah that's it about that that's it about the installation thank you